Hello and welcome to Memora. I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly. This is a puzzle game, a proper, proper puzzle game. Basically walking through the world, solving puzzles as you do. This is a sponsored video by the studio Sticky Stone Studios. I believe that is the full name. Um, yeah, it's a, it's a puzzle game. Uh, there's not really anything to talk about other than that, so let's just play the game, shall we? Alright, so we start here. Looking into the air, we can look around, walk, etc. as you do. Um, so first of all, we have some weird rune stuff around us. I feel like my... No, FOV is actually fine. Okay, I thought I... Uh, Actually, yeah, lowered the FOV or something. Okay, so uh, we got some glowing box blocks around us too. We're gonna pick these up and then try and pop one in here and see if that does exactly what we needed to do. Would you look at that? It does. All right, I'm gonna bring one of these with me because I'm sure it'll be more useful. Okay, here's a next puzzle area. Looks like we're gonna have to do more with these. Weird glowy rocks. There's another two right there that I can use as well. But yeah, it's a straight up puzzle game. Um, I don't really play these very often, but mostly that's because I'm an idiot. I like to think of myself that I am a relatively intelligent young man, but when I play puzzle games, <laughs> it usually <laughs> proves to be completely wrong. I can also rotate this in the hand. Sweet. Um, yeah, I find that uh, generally that's actually not the case. I don't know. I, I feel like I'm pretty smart with some games, but then when I play puzzle games, I just struggle tremendously. All right, let's just pop one of these in here. And I guess we'll find another one. Although there's three of those things that require... There's something else that we require. Okay. Three of those things that all have two things. Do we just need six, six of these circle things? Six of these uh, glowing rocks? I guess we could try that. See what happens. Oh, there we go. Try that. Alright, okay. There we go. So, what's that showing us? Open the scanner, okay. Okay, what is that? Uh, scan. Okay, so now I guess we have a, a picture of this so we can... We don't have to keep checking back. Okay, so... I'm guessing what this means is that we could have opened this in two ways. We could have opened it with putting both of them in, or only one in the left one. Okay, cool. And then it wouldn't have worked if we'd done none. I think that makes sense. Oh, we can have more of them. Okay, that's cool. Alright, let's uh, put that on the side. Oh, we can just keep it there. That's pretty useful. Okay, so let's grab another rock. And see about this one. I guess we'll just start with two again. See if that works or not. Come here. I'll take you with me. Alright. Let's shove that in there. Let's see if that works. It seems to. Alright, so that's another one solved. And then I guess we need to scan this as well. Okay, so that one also would have worked with two and one, okay. Gotcha. I want it like that, so yeah, now I have two things. Both of them would have worked. Oh no, that one wouldn't have worked with one. So we needed two on that one. Okay, gotcha. Uh, actually, I want to keep that open, so I scroll and then it's on the side. Okay. We also have a thing here that we unlocked. Okay, uh, I'm guessing we also unlocked something there. Yes, okay, well, we might need that later. Okay, so this one. Um, you know what? I'm going to try nothing. Let me see if that works. No, okay, because I mean that one was, both of them worked with two, and that one worked with one, so I thought maybe this one would work with nothing, but that's not true. Let's try one. Okay. Alright, that seems to work as well, cool. So I got a spare rock laying around if I need it. And that has... Okay, that one actually required only one, well that was perfect then. Uh, let's scan that. So we keep that in our mind. I guess we need it later, I guess. Okay, cool. Alright, so we got this thing here. Which I'm guessing we need for something. What about here? Okay, hold on. This one, I know we need this one. Right, because that, look, block, block, okay. We're getting somewhere. Pick that up. 
And I'm guessing we need the other two further along. Oh, let's take it out of there again. Okay. Let's take this with us. Uh, ah. Ah, there you go. Sorry, we need this one and then, like, uh, teeth or something. Okay. So it doesn't matter where we put it. Let's put this one on the left, just to be sure. Okay. And then the other one came from that thing. So far, so good. Look at that. Trucking along here. Give me that. And also jump. I'm not sure if that's going to be relevant. Maybe there's going to be jumping puzzles. Who knows. Okay, so. Let us once more move on. And that, I guess... Okay, we can bring this with us just in case we need it. Probably not. I imagine everything will be found in this area. Okay, I see two S's and then a 8. I We, we had those before. Oh, I see a bunch of shit on the right there as well. A lot of rocks laying around the place. Blue glowy rocks and things popping in. Okay. Oop, and a bit of lag. Right. Um. Oh my goodness. Oh. Open scanner. Oh, we got a map. Okay, gotcha. Oh, we can put that on the left as well. Sweet. Um. It's not teaching us how to run, I already knew that. Okay, okay, alright. Let's put that on the side. Okay, so what do we need to do here? This is clearly a puzzle as well. Um, so we got two squiggly things. Squiggly thing are going to a square or a diamond, I guess. Squiggly thing, an 8, an S, and a squig- or an 8. Um... We do have the 8s on here. On, like, the, on the left thing I'm looking now. Uh, we don't have squiggly ones in there. So maybe we avoid the squiggly ones or something? I don't... I have no idea. This one has two lines going up because it goes to that one as well as that one. I have... Okay, well, let's keep looking. Because right now I have no freaking clue. Okay, here we go. What's this? 8, S... Okay, so that's the, the square things that I need, which I used earlier, I guess. They, they don't take those rocks. Those rocks go into that. And this is like the panels that we get. And we unlock that, I guess. I don't know. We need that. I'm not just sure. Okay, what else we got? We got a puzzle here. So it looks like it might be a little bit easier than the last one. Um, I wonder if there's any meaning to this or if that's just always the same button. I'm not sure. S, squiggly line, and two eights. Okay. This one only has two things to shove in. We got two squigglies and an eight. I don't know, I need to know how to open the squiggly one, I guess. That's just a, a rock, I guess. We have diamond, two S's, two eights. This isn't telling me much. I'm getting all this information, but I'm not sure what to do about it. I guess this one is the first one that we see, so maybe we're supposed to unlock this one first so we can get an idea for what we're supposed to do. Uh, I mean, with the other ones, we had to just kind of try, didn't we? And just hope that it worked out. So why don't we just try something here? Put one in the S's. Take that. And then... Take that. That one also goes to the L on. Um, okay, let's just try something. Do it. Oh. Oh, okay, that worked, okay. Does that tell me that the S's just need a single line and not two lines? What did I do? Oh, here we go. We got a... An E, with a plus, plus E. Okay, right, well, let's leave that there for the, for the moment. Let's bring this with us over here. All right, so the S needs a single thing. That's the information we just, well, that's, that's the information I assume I just learned. So that would be, um, hmm, let's try this. So that will go to the right on the S, that will go to the top on the S, then that S will get two, because that one's going to go to the eight and then that way. But there's no way to avoid that. Um, so let's actually, yeah, no, let's try this. Okay. Okay, that, oh, that wasn't it, actually, never mind. Oh, wait, that's an, yeah, that's an eight, that's an S. Okay, hold on. I knew that. Um, let's do it. In there. I really thought I had it already because I was just doing all that stuff, but... 
Okay, that's definitely not it. So the 8 stops it, I guess, but it didn't last time. Um, okay, so what if I... I need one in that one and that one. Let's try that. Come here. Give me this rock. Okay, here we go. Then you go in there, and then boom, right? Right, boom. Uh, yes, but I don't know why exactly. The S there stopped. It didn't go upwards. Okay, and we got a picture of two humans with wings on their cheeks looking at a Metroid coming down. Can I do something that? Can I scan this? Uh, let's do uh, that one and then R. Okay, now we have the picture saved as well. Great. I'm sure that'll come in useful. Well, actually, I want to open that and do it, put it there. Okay, right. Well, we got that done. Next one. It's over there. Can I go over there? It's just a waterfall, it seems. There's a blue thing here I might need, so let's just bring that with us for now. Can I go... No, I can't go through the water. Fair enough. Alright, so what do we got here? So we still haven't learned that much, really. Um, right, okay, let's try something. Because uh, I don't, what I learned about the S appears to be wrong, I think. Let's get this one over here. Give me that. You don't need that anymore. I'm just, I don't know, because the 8, or the S stopped, like, when I put one in just now, towards the S, it actually stopped. See, that one isn't going anywhere. Okay, that wasn't it. That one lit up pretty hard. Hold on. Okay, I think it's because maybe the S is getting too much. So let's take that one and then that, right? Yes? No. Does it need to light all of them up or something? I don't know. Because then you just put one in everything, so that wouldn't be it. Maybe I need a third one. At this point, it's more like just trying random things and not actually... Um, it's not really guessing anymore, <laughs> or it's not really going off of knowledge anymore. I'm just, I'm just shoving random rocks into random places and hoping it works out. Again, this is what I mean. I'm too stupid to understand puzzles. Um, okay, so let's try... Did I shove one directly into the 8 on the last one? I don't remember. Let's just try that. In there, in there. Okay, hold on, they're all being lit up now, is that good? That's probably good. There we go. Alright, so that was good. So they, I guess they all do need to just be lit up once or something. Open the scanner again. Alright, what are we scanning here? Wait, why not? I don't want to scan that, because... Oh, shit, okay, I can okay, right, because I got one over there. Somewhere here. I didn't scan this one, did I? Well, I guess we may as well do that then. Okay, so that's our symbols. Gotcha. Alright. I didn't scan the first couple. Uh, this is, is not really giving me much information anymore. Oh, wait, unless... It is giving me information. Wait, but what is the... F okay, hold on. I think we are getting information from that. It just need. It's telling us it needs to get. Uh, okay, hold on. Because the squiggly line, we don't have information on yet, but we do have information on all the other things. So let's go to one. Like for example, the eight needs to get from both sides. So we need to put one in each of those. Okay, 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 okay. I'm I'm getting this. I'm I'm understanding now. I'm getting somewhere. Although I need to find more blue stones to be able to actually do this. Oh, here's two. Give me those. I'm gonna, need a, I'm gonna need some rocks here as well, but... This one requires all three, I think, but I might be wrong on that. I have to check out what the S needs. Okay, well, this one needs two for sure. I'm almost... I'm almost... 100% sure... That this one requires both. Because I think I'm getting... I'm getting an understanding for how this works right now. 
It's just telling you how much power each one requires. So that should be it. It's not. Wait, so then that one means it's nothing then, right? Yes. Okay, so that means that one requires no power to get going. Okay, 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 okay. Alright, hold on, what is this? Yes, right, okay, there's the information. So it requires nothing to get going. Power does nothing, no power makes it go. There we go. We're getting somewhere here. Scan that shit, sure, remember that. This is rewarding. This is why I like puzzle games. It's so rewarding to figure shit out. Uh, unfortunately, we have that Metroid thing on the same page, which kind of makes it difficult to see all the stuff, but... Alright, so... That means here... Oh, shit, sorry. Uh, that thing requires no power to get going, so if we put stuff in there, it's not going to work. But the 8 requires both things. So how the hell does that work? Um, no, it doesn't matter, of course, because it, as long as we do that one and that one, then it doesn't matter what happens there. They can go... If that one doesn't work, that's fine. No, it needs to work, though, doesn't it? Because that one requires power from two sources to be able to go. Um, the S requires source from only a single thing. Okay, I think it is those two, but I'm not sure how exactly how that's going to work with that one. We'll see. Let's get another power source. I'm guessing, because look, if that one gets power, it doesn't work, right? So we don't want it to give it power. But if I power up the S with a single thing, it's going to get powered up. So we don't want to get, the, and that one's going to go to the left, which is going to power up the S, which is going to go that way, and that one's going to stop. But that A needs to be powered by two different things, to be able to power that one by two different things. So this shouldn't work, but unless it works in a different way. See, because that one gets power, and it doesn't, it, it can't have power. Oh, wait, unless we don't... Yes, okay, of course, it just works like that. We just don't... We don't have to put anything in to power that one, because that one doesn't need power to get going. Yeah, see, it just goes automatically. Wait, but that's still... Right, 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 I gotcha. I need one in every... In all three of them. Because I need to... If I put two in that, in those two then the S won't work, which means that one doesn't get power, which means that one goes up, but still, this one goes still up to the 8, and that one goes up to... Okay, okay, I need a third one. Oh, this is so rewarding. I'm, I'm figuring this shit out. I'm starting to run out of these rocks, though. <laughs> Surely there's enough out there somewhere. Okay. I gotcha. Give me that shit. Get my scanner out. See, because that one goes, and then boom. Done, Zoid. All right. This is going well. Where's my reward? There it is. It's a thing. Sweet. I love it. Okay. Right. Uh, I'm gonna leave that in there for now. Okay, so this... I see a blue thing there. Is that one of those things that I need? I didn't see that last time. Yes. Okay, give me that. Any more around here? Yes, there's another one over here. Man, I should've used these ones earlier. Save me a lot of trouble. Let's pop them over here for a second so I know where they are. Alright. Moving on to what I think is the final puzzle. That one right there. And then we just gotta put in the right things in here, which shouldn't be a problem. So, I wonder if there's any more blue things around. Because if there's not, then it likely means that there are, oh, we only need these two of them. Although, no, I brought one as well, didn't I, from the big, from the other area, so maybe I only need one here. Yeah, because the squiggly things don't need any power. Okay, I can figure this one out by myself. Okay, so squiggly ones don't need power. What about the uh, square? Square can either take one or two. Okay. So we put uh, nothing in there, because that one doesn't require power, which means it powers that one up. Then that one goes there, which means that one doesn't work. Which means I need to... Put one in there to make sure that one gets power from... Wait, no, hold on. I need to put one in there, which means that one doesn't get the power required, which means that one goes off. Okay, so I need to put one in there, I think. Because um, that will make that one go off. Then I need to not put that one... Um, the 8 requires 
two, yes. And then the S requires one only. Which means... How am I going to power the eight then? I'm not. I'm gonna, I need to put one in each of those. Because the S only requires one, so I need to make sure the eight doesn't go off by putting one in there, because then that one doesn't go off. And then that one gets only one, and then now we're done. Right, I need one more of these blue things to make this happen. Give me a blue thing. Where does one find more... Oh, here we go. Perfect. Alright, I'm getting it. First ten minutes of the video may have been a bit stupid, but now... We're getting somewhere. Watch this shit. Exactly as planned. Boom, boy! Scan that shiz. Oh, there it is. Gonna start scanning right away. Alright, it's a thing. Great. Now, give me all these things. I'm gonna plop them in here. Oh shit, what's this now? Uh. Oh, wait, hold on. The 8 gets powered by 2, the S gets powered by 1, the square gets powered by 2. Okay, so I need 3 of these things. I didn't actually need 4 of them, I guess. Okay, yep, I think so anyway. Uh, we probably need this one. Because I assume we need the symbol as well. Well, this doesn't actually look like the right symbol, so maybe that one's the one that we don't need. What about this? Uh, oh, yeah, that just gave me more information. We need that one, I think. Do we? I don't know. I guess we'll uh, just bring it over here and have a look. Uh, yes, this one looks like the... No, it doesn't actually. That's the wrong one as well. Wait, what? How many are there? I think I only have one more of these, right? Or do I have one more over there as well? I'm not sure. We'll find out. I definitely need this one. That's gonna go in the S. And then I need... Wait, but those are wrong as well. They're not the right ones at all. Nothing looks correct here. Well, let's find out what the final thing is. Which there isn't. I think I got them all already, didn't I? Unless the actual symbols don't matter, but I imagine that they do. It's gotta be the right ones, right? Well, maybe... Yeah, I think I got all of them. Okay, well in that case... Um, we just need... Oh wait, you can... Oh, that doesn't help actually. If we could turn them as well, which I don't know if that would help or not, but... Yeah, that's giving me a wrong symbol. Wait, why does that change the symbol? What if I shove this in here? Just to get an idea of what's going on here. Uh, well, that's almost correct, right? Um, hold on. Let me take all these fucking things out of here for a second. Let's pop them down here. I was doing well, and I've been I'm, I've been f I've been faced with a different puzzle, and I need to figure this one out. Okay, so we need to we need to get that. So those ones are correct, right? They gotta be. No, but there's a plus sign there. The plus the plus sign is messing things up. That one is correct, although their gap seems to be too large in the middle, which is a bit weird. Right? Because the gap there is just the one square, whereas that, it's like a line. So I don't feel like that's correct either, but... Um, that one just goes too far up with the wings, the wingy bits. So perhaps... This will, like, you just need the right combination of the ones. Let's try something again. I feel like I tried this exact combination before. What is that? Hold on. No. It was definitely not. The S doesn't need more than one thing, though, right? That's the other thing we need to figure out. Is that, yeah, the S only needs one power source, so we it's only three of these. I mean, how many combinations could there possibly be? 
right? Let's just pop some things in and see which one works, I guess. Jesus, what is that? Monstrosity. Um, like, it's just... Uh, like, there are... there. There's nothing that's completely correct, is the problem. Oh! Ah, now we're getting somewhere. Hold on. Yes, I guess we do need all the power sources then. Okay. I guess the combinations, they somehow mix and match so that things disappear. Okay. Goodbye, area. Hello, new area. It looks identical. Oh, no, it doesn't. The atmosphere changed drastically. My goodness. All right. So we got a uh, thing. Open the symbol page. Project the symbol. Ah! Um, that's pretty good size. What do we do? Project. Okay. Sweet, we got some stairs. Get rid of this thing. Alright. Didn't expect that. What's this? Symbols on poles. Okay. And some kind of mechanism here. Just immediately jumping into things to seeing. <laughs> Is this gonna work? <laughs> Alright. Uh, we have different symbols. That looks like the eight, but it's. It looks obviously. Slightly different, because it's, uh. Skewed. But I don't know if that matters. Because that's the S, basically, but again, skewed. I think they're the same symbols, just skewed. So. Oh gosh, this is gonna be confusing. Right. Let's start with something a little more simple, perhaps. Okay, this is pretty looks our end goal. We gotta go over here. There's some stuff up up there. Wait, can I go that way? No, that, that's behind the wall. Well, I feel like, <laughs> if we're being serious, we could probably squeeze Dude through there, but... Fair enough, game. I'll play by your rules. Okay, so we got eight uh, and two S's. The S's require a single power source. The... Eight requires two. So, we just put one in here. And that's it. Watch this. Is that where powers of the S's and which powers of the eight? Right. I probably need to do something else as well. Oh no, wait, I did something. Look at that. That was actually, that was actually correct. Okay. I'm guessing that's just one part of the puzzle. Okay, there's another part. Okay, so we got uh, simply an S here. Or no, an A. It's only two of these. Okay. Fair enough. That's not too bad. So it's the same puzzle, except in a different way. Clever girl. Oh, wait. Where does that go? Oh, that just goes over there. Right, so that's going to be the second one. Done. So means that goes up even further. Now I have something to put in here, I guess. Right. Now, we've got two more of these, I'm guessing. Uh, where does this one go? That one's this one. This one looks like the toughest one. Wait, okay, and where does the other one go, then? Oh, it's the same one. Okay, this last, last one looks tough, but it, it's going to power up both of them, it looks like. Okay, right. Man, this is... I kind of wish I had an overhead view of this one. Square. Square uh, can have either two or one. Eight can have two, or needs to have two. Squiggly line needs nothing. Um, eight needs two, S needs one, eight needs two. Okay. Let's get some stones over here, just so I can get something done if I need to. Mostly putting off the inevitability of having to figure this out. It's gonna be a proper brain to use this one. Okay. We have three places where we, no four places where we can put something in. I very much doubt I need all four, but Okay, let me jump on one of these things so I maybe have a better view of what's going on. Uh okay, so that one requires two. The eight here requires both two as well. Actually that one can be part up by one, so putting one in here. 
would power up all three of these things. Which means I probably need to put one in there, so let's just get started on that. But it's not actually necessary, because this 8 would also... Or sorry, this one would also power up that one. And this one gets powered up by... 1. That one, 8 needs 2. Does this go... Oh, uh, no, that doesn't go that way. That one goes all the way over here, though. So if we power up this 8, then that one has 1 as well. So that's powering up that, 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 and part of that. This one does not have a path here. That one doesn't need power. Okay, so we basically don't put anything in here. That one gets powered up as well. This one requires two, so I can't put anything in there. It gets power from here if I don't put up power in that one. Um, and then it gets power from this one if I put a power in here. Okay, I think I got it. Put one in here. Put one in here. Did I just fucking nail this on the first try? Yes, I did! Oh, man! Are you guys following this shit? I'm proud of myself there. <laughs> okay. Uh, I guess I opened the door. Right. I, uh, I don't actually get anything here. Oh, I was I wanted to go on the walking or the moving platform. Okay, what's this now? Oh, it's lag. Okay, here we go. We got several more things to shove in. We need to form three different symbols. Oh god, the frames. What is this? Okay, sorry about that. Um, ugh, those frames are kind of bad. We got three different symbols. Is that it? Look around properly. There must be a lot of area around there that's messing things up for me. Oh, here we go. Trying to hide, you sneaky little bastard. Okay. Right. So we have... Um, I mean, to be fair, what happened last time is it ended up being kind of... Um, okay, so... The squares can get powered up by two different things or one thing. So I, I can't use all four, or I can use three, or I can use two. Um, but yeah, what I did last time, we just kind of tried stuff out and it somehow worked out. Uh, I feel like on the left... ...needs to be... ...these two. That one, and that one. I was wrong. So what about... Uh, no, it wouldn't be that one, would it? Let's try. No, but then it would be... Wait, no, 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 not that one. This one. Oh, I'm stuck behind my own stones. And I already tried that one, so call me that one, that one. No. Damn it. This one we tried already and it wasn't it. But it's close. Unless it doesn't need to look like that, it just needs to end up looking like that in the end. Hold on, okay, let's um try shoving these two in there and see what happens, right? Oh, I got an achievement. Symbol plate lover one. Okay, that's clearly not it. <laughs> that's just the big old fucking square. Okay, that's not it. Um Right, so what am I where am I going wrong exactly? Like these ones they both look like they could belong there. Uh which one is more likely to belong in the other place? I have no idea. Okay. I it's it's been 20 to 25 minutes uh i've been trying this the whole time and i just can't figure it out so i figured fuck it i'm gonna look it up because i am that kind of person but i didn't actually look up the answer yet i mean i tried to and then i clicked on a video of someone doing this puzzle where i had to skip all the way through to like an hour in um and i noticed something you can change these things 
And it doesn't do anything right now, but when I put in a couple blocks, so just shove in that one and shove in this one just to have a look. That's changing things. Oh, look, I got that one. Wait, that's no, that's not quite correct, but it's almost. Okay, hold on. So, which one is the one that isn't correct here then? Uh, the middle bit, so well, actually either one, but let's take out that one for a sec. Okay, so that's clearly how we need to do this. Kind of wish I figured that out a little bit sooner. Uh, not quite. No. Okay, hold on. Let's try getting rid of that one. Oh, wait, sorry. No, keeping that one in. And I'm putting in... Which one did I take out? This one. Yes. That's one. Okay, which means that these two are clearly the ones I need here. Alright, so let's shove this in for a second. And um, okay, it doesn't switch anything around unless you change that as well. So let's do that. And then it's that one. No, it's not. I thought I had it for a second there. Okay, I'm pretty sure. Oh wait, wait, wait. Okay, of course we change this one. Yes. Ah, oh, thank fuck. <laughs> I spent so long on that. Oh, if only I knew I needed. I could just change those things. I didn't realize that was that was my mistake. I didn't look, because I was properly trying to think outside the box and everything. I was like, oh, maybe you need to overlap it in a way where it makes things disappear. Like, maybe you're supposed to look for, maybe you need to reverse it or something. I was looking on the back of each panel to see, oh, maybe the puzzle piece on the back is different. But, uh, no, it was none of that. It was just me not realizing I was supposed to click something. But uh, with this, I understand why the, the game was, um, FPS dropped a little bit, by the way, now. <laughs> but yeah, with this beautiful view in the back, I'm actually going to end this episode. Uh, this will end up being like 30 to 35 minutes long at least since I... Well, I, I'll take out all the me figuring it out by myself. Um, but even then, it'll still be long enough. But yeah, this is actually really fun. This is... Uh, I, yeah. That, I, I, again, <laughs> I find myself... I generally think of myself as a relatively clever person. When I play puzzle games, I always tend to suck at them. But I do enjoy them. It's actually really... It's really um, rewarding when you figure something out. I was really honestly, like, 40 minutes ago, <laughs> at this point for you guys, I'm like 15 minutes ago, when I figured out those other puzzles, I was legitimately happy with myself. It's, it's such a rewarding feeling. But uh, anyway, that'll be that for now. If you guys are interested in playing this game yourself, I will, of course, could put a link in the description to the Steam page and all that. I would, uh, if you like puzzle games, definitely recommend it. Okay, the graphics are kind of nice as well. Um... I, can't, I must say, it, it runs a bit odd. Um, I'm playing this, to be fair, on 1440p, though. Although, downscaled for YouTube does 18... Uh, or 1080p, sorry. So, if I was playing this on 1080p, it probably would run completely fine. And I upped the graphics all the way as well, because the developers wanted me to show showcase the graphics. Which are nice. They look um, pretty. It's, just, it's a nice... I mean, it's just not trying to go for a realistic look or anything, but it's a nice, pretty environment. Um, but anyway, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Until next time, have a good day and goodbye.